It is July X, 2011, and I'm making my Earth driving video of going... Oh, fuck, I gotta get this fucking traffic. God, oh, it's so fucking hot today. I hate this fucking heat. Well, actually, a cold phone came through. But not a very good one. Out of four degrees right now. 84 degrees. <laughs> And I fucking am really starting to get fucking tired of it already. I was very lucky last month where it only got too fucking hot, you know, a few times. And it would, um, actually a halfway decent cold front would come through. And the high would only be in the 60s. And yet people are bitching about it because people are fucking assholes. You know, yeah, it's so, it's so bad to be comfortable. It says, get fucking real. I mean, bitching about being in the fucking 60s. Fucking assholes. Oh, it's so fucking great now where I live it. It gets so fucking hot when I put the air conditioner on that the electric bill is so fucking high. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to be fucking delighted because people tell me that it's fucking great when it's so fucking hot out. But when it got too fucking hot yesterday, it wasn't as bad as uh, it was last week. I think the dew point only came up to about X to or something, but I haven't been able to check that. And there really is, there's no fucking end to it now. There's no fucking day where it's, where we're going to have high in the oven, 70s, 70s again. I mean, that would be a significant improvement. If it's over 75 degrees, I don't fucking like it. It's too fucking hot. Oh, and I'm only going over the bridge that collapsed. Well, not this one, but the one before it collapsed. Oh, and it, we're still in the a government shutdown. The media and all their fucking bullshit. I mean, I will be able to see doctors and things like that during the shutdown. It won't affect me. For the insurance I have, I think it's a... It's kind of a non-profit thing that's not associated with the government. If you actually have something that's not for profit, so these money-grubbing scumfuck shitbag from those scumfucks who think it's so great that it's privatize all this shit and then they fuck you over because all they care about is their bottom line but somehow they've been able to get away with this shit for so long these people are stupid assholes and pulling up getting away with all that shit Well, the 4th of July was pretty, was better than most holidays have been recently. Oh god, there's people I can't talk about because they might be watching my videos. And there's someone who's, I really hate his fucking guts, but I can't talk about him because he might watch a YouTuber. He might be the, the person who was telling me this shit that I might be, that he reported me and all this bullshit. I get a feeling it's someone I know. I can't mention his name. Because he's a real fucking arrogant fucking shitbag who wants to force his, uh, his uh, opinions and his ideas down my fucking throat. But of course it made me only more, more militant and defiant. Because I hate people like that. As though some uptight, arrogant fucking douchebag is supposed to be... I'm supposed to revolve my life around their concerns. Because they happen to feel that way. So I'm supposed to live my life according to them, not the way I want to live my life. So I guess that kind of... Something I did around the Earth of July. I got, got to see my friend Karen and Larry. I don't know, I think, I don't, you see, there's another thing coming up is a, a picnic uh, for people with Asperger's syndrome on, uh, on the 9th, and they gotta worry about being able to fucking even get there. I'm scheduled to work, and then the people meet at the place for the picnic at noon, so I'm not gonna be able to 
Oh god, that's gonna be a fucking problem unless I leave early. And the person hosting it is called Kong an autism picnic. I, I don't know, I don't really like the word autism. I don't know. And then they want to fucking get rid of the Asperger label. And somehow, even if they do get rid of it, I don't think people are going to give up that name. But I don't know if it, it might be a slow indoctrination process. Of ten, and ten years from now, they might not be saying Asperger's anymore. writer's group is meeting tonight, so I'm going to the writer's group after Old Country Buffet, but then I gotta feel kind of rushed. That's the part that fucking sucks. Then try to alternate between different Old Country buffets throughout the metro. I hope she got killed in a car accident. Probably no such luck. But that wishful thinking is always good. I was able to do my uh, spoken words at Karen's place and Larry's mostly uncensored. <laughs> I left more of the more extreme things out, but, um, I was able to get most of it in. I knew I could have done as much as I could. I would have, um, bought some other things. See, the 4th of July went pretty good, actually. Then fireworks was from the casino, and they, they put out the best fireworks display from anyone. Well, they have the most money. God, they, they can take buses for free to the casino. I, I don't go there that often, though. There, you know, there may be a couple times a year. It, if it were for the buffet, there, it would actually... Would, oh, God. I couldn't fucking stand being there. And, of course, the idea is to get you to spend... I mean, they give you free rides on the buses because they want you to fucking gamble and go through all your fucking money. And yeah, for spending $13 on a buffet is, is to me, is a lot better investment. You need as much as I want, even take my time until the bus leaves. I do feel kind of stuck there. Most lots of times I've taken the bus from the Mall of America because it leaves the latest because I don't I think staying in a buffet for Four hours is too fucking long. The other buses get there they're on Ixerta, and then the buses, that next bus doesn't leave until 11. So, oh god, I get uncomfortable there, and they got fucking cameras all over the place. Oh god, I hate being watched like that, big fucking brother. Yeah, the Indians believe in, or the, well, not, not when they get corrupt. At a casino without corruption, I mean, about the thug economy. Or they say casinos is what's to save the economy. That's pretty fucked up. To spend their money on all you can eat buffets instead of other things and pissing away at the casinos that you don't fucking win. 
It's not, it's not designed for you to win, it's designed for them to win. Before I leave the buffet, I got to get the... The cat has been constipated from time to time. I got to get him that stuff that he looks so he can take a shit easier. He's starting to have that fucking problem. And that problem with the last cat I had. There's two uh, pet stores. I'm, I think pet... Oh, it's a little cheaper in prices. I hope, because I'm probably... Oh, God. I've had a fucking time for all this. The writers' group meets at Evan. The Law of Attraction group meets tonight, but because the writers' group and the Law of Attraction is meeting the same night, I am going to pick the writers' group over the Law of Attraction group. Most of the time, the writers' group meets on Monday, but because of the... Uh, well, I'm going to stop this and make a part new. 